Hey guys, it's going to Brady here. Yeah, I um I'm in front of the light. I'm trying something a little bit different. I am pasty white because of just like the way my light looks. I'm backing up a little because I know how pasty white I am in this lighting. I am doing a lot of remodeling. I am thankful that my dad was able to help me out with this and I really appreciate him for that and shout out to him because he if I he wouldn't I wouldn't have done be able to do this because so basically what we did was we put we got like this black it's like cardboard paper that you can get at like Michael's or whatever for like four bucks. We put it around my desk, we drilled it in, and then we put LED lights under it because now the cords you can't see. Like you obviously you see the cords coming from the computer, but you can't see the cords like that are all around and it's it's really nice in here. I'll I'll actually show that off quick here. So as you can see, so we put, you can barely see it, but there's the rods right here. So that's like the rods that were on the desk. These were not on there. We installed the black on there. And it's really, really nice. And as you can see, like, it's just the cords that go, like, under here. So we made it easier, and then the vent's still there, so. But no, I really do like this, because it, it just gives, it gives it depth, you know? It's, and it's just, like, I can move the computer all the way to the corner. I'm not, like, worried about cords. Obviously, I'm a little worried, because I gotta, when I move out, I'm gonna have to, like, go down the road. But I don't, I'm not moving out for a while, so. For a little bit, I'd say, until I finish college, so. But I'll, I'll update you guys on that if you guys want a video on that. But anyway, I'm going to show you guys with them on. Ha! Huh? Bro, it is so clean. and I'm I, So I think this is the brightest setting. I might turn them down a little bit. Even if it's not even that bright, it's just, it's so clean. Look at that. It's like, I didn't think we could put it on there, but I we, <laughs> we managed to put it on there. And the thing is, it's like you're going to be looking at it like this. It's so, so cool. And cause it's like you can do any color, like you can just do the regular color. So this is, you guys, I don't know if you guys remember the LED lights that I used to have in my room, but they were, yeah, they were, they, they just stopped working. Like if I'm gonna be honest with you, I have no idea why they stopped working at all. Like they just shut off and I tried turning them on and it would just flicker. And a lot of, I tried looking up videos and stuff and then everybody's like, oh, just like switch it around. And it's like, I did that and it didn't work, so. A lot of slacking on these YouTube tutorials out there. But no, yeah, I am hoping to get a new lamp because <laughs> we don't talk. That's, it's like, so hold on, let me let me paint the picture for you. You got like this cool, so obviously I'm gonna reorganize this, but like this is like my, my entertainment area. And then you got like the cool like layout of just like stuff to show off. You got my sweet, awesome new setup and with the PS4 over there, cause I'm gonna be playing more games on that. But then next thing you know, got a freaking log lamp in here and it's like that's my fault but I need because this light here is the worst this light is just super 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 annoying <laughs> I'm actually really glad that I was able to show you guys like the desk and setup because I'm gonna be streaming on YouTube so if you guys are not subscribed to irix master go make sure you subscribe to my gaming channel I wanted to show you guys another thing that I ordered I forgot so this is just a box I gotta get rid of this so it's not it's nothing crazy but it's just uh, it's just storage, you know? Obviously, there's not like, a lot of room in my bed, and my bed's really long, and you're probably thinking, like, why would you put it next to the door? But it's, it's, it's a nice little thing, too, because you can people can sit on it. I can always drag it over and have people, like, hang out and stuff instead of just having it be one gaming chair and a bed, you know? They actually have a spot to sit next to my bed, and then it could be a spot for gaming. And then um, all I did with it was, and it's super heavy right now. The reason for that is because I put my weight blanket in there, but... I just put all my blankets in there right now. Um, I do want to say that I am still working on the short film. Uh, I'm still calling it uh, wrong number and stuff like that. And it's going to be a little bit of different style stuff that I've had. Obviously, it'll still have some of the same elements that I've had throughout a lot of my films. But the only difference is that I'm making the music. And this is my first time making the music, so bear with me and stuff, obviously, on the scenes. I'd say the one thing that was really hard about making this film was that it was freaking freezing. It was cold outside. I'd say it was like a good 30 degrees or lower and it was raining. It was trying to snow, but it was mostly raining. And uh, we did get like, like drenched. I'd say me and Eric got really drenched because we were out in the rain the most. And then uh, Grace was able to help us film, which was very good because if she didn't, some of the scenes probably looked, looked a little worse than, like, than they do because there's the scenes where it's like me and Eric are in the same shot, it would look kind of weird being on a tripod. But 
I'm really glad that it, this is some this is like an experiment because me and Eric are gonna be probably hanging out a lot more. Well, obviously hanging out more, and we're gonna be making a ton more films and stuff. And I'm really hoping next summer is that we can film Cornfield. And I want to. I ended up talking to a lot of my college people. The college people. <laughs> <laughs> College people. That, that's funny. I don't know why it was. <laughs> no, I've been talking to a lot of them. A few of them actually do want to help me out with stuff because I was telling them, it's like, yeah, I've been doing a lot of films and stuff and I have a vlog channel and I like to post films and stuff on here because of the stuff that I really like to make and improve on. And I had some people that it's like, oh, if you have projects you're working on, like, just let me know and be able to hook up and be able to actually be able to shoot something. I'm just like thinking, if I get some people from college to help shoot Cornfeared, that'd be freaking sweet. <laughs> because realistically, it's like, not only do we have like more more heads and stuff or to like kind of come up with ideas, but it's just not like winging it, you know? And we have like three people, we can have two people running two cameras on different angles and actually be able to get like one scene done in one take, you know what I mean? And stuff like that, instead of having it be like one camera over here doing the same job, one camera over here doing the same thing over and over, you know? It would just be better. If you guys have any questions about like corn fear and all that stuff, I might make some videos down the road about it. Me, Adam, and Eric have it all planned out for the last two films. We have it planned out. We just haven't. We we just haven't had time. Like mostly this this summer was packed, man. We we were all working a ton, and uh, Eric had just got his like new job too, so he was work. He started working a lot, and then Adam, he's working and stuff too. So we were all just kind of busy with everything, and we were like, you know what? We're just gonna. We're all schedules are busy, so we'll probably have to really plan out something because I think the way I wanted to do it was I'm hoping down like in the summer and stuff when it gets warmer and stuff, we have a weekend and we all like, can hang out and stuff and chill and then we can film it and all and that'd be awesome. That would be just peachy. But anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed. Make sure you smack that like button, make sure you subscribe. I hope you guys have missed me because believe me, I've missed doing this. I'm going to be having a clean, clean schedule. I'm really hoping to get back into this. I I want to shoot for Mondays or uh, Wednesdays are kind of like the main vlogs. If you guys are not subscribed to my gaming channel or my reaction channel or review channel, it's called, go subscribe to them because I'm going to be posting all those too. So, yeah. But anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed. See you guys later.